for the day to you is Esther Davis on location in Arlington, Texas, home of the Dallas Cowboys. You know where we are? We're at LA's Hair and Scalp Clinic. Dr. Linda Amerson. I just walked in. She's in a brand new location over here on Parkway. And we are going Pioneer Parkway. I'm going to give you the address, the telephone number. Go get a pen and a piece of paper because we're going to tell you how to take care of your scalp. All of the terminologies that you don't know, she is going to explain them to you. And I am going to talk to some of her clients. She's somewhere doing something else. So while we're here, Dr. Linda Amerson, LA's Hair and Scalp Clinic, we're going to talk about hair on this segment of Esther Davis. With me right now is actually a client. How are you? Give me I'm your good. name and number. I'm Sabetha Lewis. Sabetha Lewis. Mm -hmm. And I say your name and number because you, uh, you know, you're so young. You could probably give your age, couldn't you, if you wanted to? Yeah, I'm 38. All right. Yeah. Well, you are. <laughs> that's a wonderful age. Yeah, it is. Now you're here at LA's Hair and Scalp. Yes, ma'am. Clinic. And mm -hmm. what are you doing? What's, what? Why are you waiting for Dr. Amerson? Well, I'm waiting for one of my appointments mm. with Dr. Amerson. Okay. And. Um, had some situations with my scalp. Oh, as, really? Your hair I, looks so beautiful. What yeah, was... well, as I'm getting older, uh -huh. I'm noticing a lot of mm -hmm. dandruff. I actually get pimples in my scalp. You it get gets, pimples in your scalp? Yeah, it's sore to the touch sometimes. And I notice a little thinning. And I know thinning runs in my family. Okay. But I wanted to make sure that I'm kind of young still, so I want to keep my hair without quickly going into wigs and weaves and all that stuff. So I saw Dr. Emerson's advertisements in the newspaper. Okay. I've heard her on the radio. Wow. And so I want to give her a try. And how and long have you been coming? Well, actually, I've been coming for a few months with appointments every other Thursday, you know, oh. and she comes in and she does my scalp with the um, little electric thing and it feels awesome. And I have to ask her about the little electric thing. And it's nice and quiet, <laughs> but it massages the scalp, she says, for growth or whatever. And I've been seeing a lot of growth. Really? Yes. And also following up with her products at home. Products? So which, which one is your favorite? I actually have the shampoo, which okay. is great and it smells minty and it makes the scalp tingle and just... Now, do you do your own hair? I do my own hair at home, yes. Ooh, sometimes, you yep. are a good person. And then sometimes I go to the salon for something special. Okay, but normally, okay. every two or three days, I do my own hair. I shampoo. Okay. So you like the shampoo? I love the shampoo. Good. I love the revitalizing conditioner, which actually does the tingling as well. Okay. It's wonderful. Smells great. Then I also have the hair oil, the anti-itch oil for the hair and scalp. Because and you were so initially having an itching problem with yes, your scalp. Yes, yes. Well, I didn't realize how common that was. It actually is. And most of it is hereditary for some people. Mm -hmm. I know for me it mm -hmm. is. Mm -hmm. But I didn't notice these things until recently. Okay. So, yeah, so I'm coming in and she's been doing a fabulous job. I love it. Just love the treatment that I'm getting. And she treats you wonderfully and you feel relaxed. She, has, she still has a bubbly personality. I haven't seen definitely, her in a while. Definitely, definitely. And she <laughs> makes you feel special and all the great things that comes along with that. So. Well, your hair is lovely. Well, thank you. So lovely. Thank, thank you. you so much for taking time to talk thank to you. We're waiting for Dr. Amerson. She's with a client at the moment. So don't go away. I'll be right back. I'm just walking around Dr. Amerson's uh, clinic here. She's still with some of her clients, but I ran into something that was sort of interesting. Good afternoon. How are you? Oh, I'm good. How are you? And you are? I'm Gary Miller. Hi, Gary. Esther Davis. Nice to meet you. What are you doing? Oh, I'm sitting here reading an article. I've one of Dr. Emerson's uh, articles that she's written recently. Oh, that's right. She does write a lot of articles, and this one is? Trendsetters to Trendsetters. Okay, so you're sitting here sort of relaxing, but something is going on, Gary. What's going on here? Oh, well, I'm receiving my monthly treatment that I receive for, um, for you know, lesions and different things like that. I was having some scalp problems, so wow. I looked up Dr. Amerson, and she made a diagnosis for me, and I, I use her product line, and I get these treatments once a month, and I have seen an improvement on the lesions. So there are three infrared lights here that are aimed at your scalp. What happens when, while this is going on? Well, I don't know if you can feel it or not, but... Oh, I actually, feel the heat. <laughs> it, it's a heat that kind of gives you a little tingle. Oh. Right there. You can feel it penetrating your scalp a little. 15 minutes. About 10, 15 minutes. Once a month. Once a month. Well, I don't know where Dr. Amerson is, but she's somewhere around. Gary, thank you so much for letting me barge in on your precious time here. No problem. Thank you. Well, it's Esther Davis. I'm still at the, at the uh, clinic. So... 
I will find her and we'll be right back with Dr. Linda Amerson at LA's Hair and Scalp Clinic. More and more people seem to be pulling their hair out over hair loss and other maladies of the scalp and hair. Dr. Linda Amerson holds a doctorate degree in trichology and has over 25 years of experience as an award-winning hair care professional and is often featured as a guest columnist in various national and international hair magazines. I felt my scalp problem was not controllable and would have to result to wearing hats or wigs. Dr. Amerson's scalp treatments, along with improving my eating habits, has made all the difference. Healthy hair begins with a healthy scalp, and the health of your scalp is directly affected by internal factors such as nutrition, medication, and disease. Purchase your therapeutic essential product today at LA's Hair and Scalp Clinic, 2304 West Pioneer Parkway, Suite 6, Arlington, Texas, 76013. Call 817 265 8854. Call today. We've been at LA's Hair and Scalp Clinic for the last few minutes, but we haven't found the star herself, Dr. Linda Amerson. She has to be in this room right here. Hello, Dr. Amerson. Hello, Esther. How are you? I am I want you to know I have been in your clinic now for the last few minutes talking to your clients. We went in the infrared area. Yes. Some one of your clients was reading the news, reading your magazine article yes. or one of your news articles. Yes. And the lady in the waiting room was uh, actually just raving about your products. Fabulous. Fabulous. <laughs> What's going on in here? What are you doing? Well, this is my client, Yolanda Smith, and we are actually giving her a microscopic analysis of her scalp and hair. A microscopic analysis? Yes. Okay. I'm using my tricholoscope. Wow. Yes. You know, I think I've seen that on the commercial you're running with the Esther Davis show. Is that correct? That is correct. Technology is Technology wonderful. is wonderful. Yes. So now, your client that was in the waiting room did mention something that I had not heard before. She has, uh, she was saying she used all of your products. She loved the shampoo. Yes. And she'd been coming for about 90 days. Yes. Do you remember? You know who I'm talking about? Yes, Sabatha. Sabatha, okay. Yes, I do. Um, we have seen tremendous success uh, with her coming on a consistent basis. And that's one of the keys when I do make a recommendation mm -hmm. uh, for a treatment for the client to be committed and come on a consistent basis. And wow. we will most definitely see results. Well, and uh, with Yolanda, Yolanda, the smile just stays on your face. <laughs> <gasps> yes. Now, once you finish, are you going to make a recommendation for Yolanda? Do you, most of your clients have this treatment? It varies according to what the diagnosis is. Okay. Uh, not everyone receives the same treatment. Mm -hmm. uh, for mm -hmm. example, I do use uh, sometimes an ultraviolet uh, treatment. I use an infrared in some cases. Now, is that where Gary was sitting reading one of your articles? Gary was receiving the infrared okay. today. That's okay. That's correct. And then for the more severe scaly scalp conditions, I sometimes have to customize my treatments. Okay. Uh, for example, with, if they have uh, pityriasis amniotisia, which is the one of the most severe forms of scaling. Okay, uh, severe forms, forms of scaling. Yes, that's a different form of treatment. Mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. then if a person has psoriasis, that's something different that I treat also. Well, let me ask you a very important question, because a lot of women wear wigs and extensions. Is it fair to assume that the wearing of wigs and extensions will cause a scalp problem somewhere along the line? Not in all cases. Okay. Uh, there are some consumers who do have other contributing factors that mm. contribute to some of the disorders. For mm -hmm. example, medications that ah, are internal. That's true. And then sometimes external as well as uh, hairstyles can also contribute as well as chemicals. Chemicals on your yes, hair. Chemicals in excess. Dr. Linda Amerson and we are at the clinic and we're talking about her wonderful line of products, the articles that she has written. <gasps> Look at all of the magazine articles that you have written. Yes. Sister to Sister, Trendsetters. Yes, a total of 23 national magazine publications. Applause to Dr. Linda Amerson. We're on location in Arlington, Texas. Thank you so much, doctor. I'll let you get back to work. Thank you so much. Bye. Bye-bye.